Welcome back to Ashing Outdoors. Got my helper here. So if you watched the video before of me building the trellis um, for my house, see this is what happens when you build something that's, that sort of looks somewhat good. Now we got the uh, opportunity to build the mother-in-law a trellis for her Mother's Day and her birthday because they're kind of like in the same time. So. It's kind of nice because I got my helper here and he's going to basically build it for me. I'm just going to do all the dangerous stuff, right? So hopefully he can do a little bit better and, and do some measuring. But uh, it's just going to be kind of like a little quick vlog today. And it's just going to be me and him doing some work out here and I uh, hope you guys enjoy. I'm better at this than my dad. Oh. <laughs> wide total on this and those four by fours I think are three and three quarter all right so if we want this to be 48 inches wide total and we have two three and a half inch wide four by fours that are going to go on the outside how wide do we want to make this inside piece uh, yeah. do you know how to do that or no? no okay so if we have two pieces that we know are going to be on the inside, the four by four, they're going to be three and a half inches wide. Let's take three and a half times two because we know we got two of them, right? Seven. So it's seven inches. Now if we want a 48 inches total, what's in between, what's this have to be in the middle to get it to be 48? 41. Okay, so we want this to be 41 inches, right? Yeah. All right, so if we cut this, How many inches is that? A little over 96, huh? Yeah. So we cut, what's 41 times two? Because we're gonna need two pieces. 82. 82, so we cut it to 82 inches. And then we cut it directly in half. Does that mean we'll get 41 inches? Come over here, mark 41 inches. Mark it down towards the inch. That'll work. Get your glasses on. Okay. So you gotta make sure you hold it down. Use both hands. Up here. You're gonna have to push this button in and then pull the trigger. Do not have this cocked because it'll kick out on you. make it all the way through. All right, so now we have our first piece. Let's double check the measurement. What's it say? What's the measurement on that? 41. 41 on the dot. Now to make this easy, let's just do it like this. So we know this is the length we want. All right. Good? Yep. And I also threw salt dust at you. All right, so we know that right here, where we want the pencil. So we're gonna take this, we're gonna wrap it around. Boom, how about that, huh? So we're gonna go ahead and hold this down right here. We're gonna make our line. Good job. Think that'll work? Maybe. We'll find out. What are you doing? Nothing. Just thinking of some something fun. 
What? When you mean by meaty, do you mean sick? I do. Okay, so I just got done sandpapering this little tiny board right here and this one up here in the middle. Now I'm going to drill holes where those little tiny lines are. I don't know if you can see that. And I'm going to do it in that one too. So I'm going to use that kind of drill. This is going to be fun. Ready? Yep. Now you not we're gonna pull it back out a little bit so it can clear the shavings. Pull it out. Keep it running, pull it out. See it clear all the shavings? Mm -hmm. Now you can push it back down in there again. Alright, pull it out, keep it running and pull it out. There you go. Now we gotta, you want as deep as it'll go, so we're gonna yeah, have to get, hot. yeah, it'll get hot, so be careful. But you want as deep as that'll go, so now we're gonna do it the other side, and then we'll flip them over and finish the holes. All right. Make sure that thing's right dead center of that cross. There you go, and then stand it up straight. That's a just... little off here. Go that way, there you go. Pull it out. I feel like that's a little off. Here, let me show you. Dad. All right. Matt, yeah, so, I'll look at my emails. Me and my dad. I'll look at my emails. Right now, back here, right? this is what it kind of looks like. It's kind of just... This is what me and my dad are imaging right now. Yeah. And... Hello. All right, so, when my dad gets this in i'm going to be up here going from here and up to the very end sanding it with that so and then after we get this done we we well once my dad gets this piece in uh we think we're gonna call it a night and all right guys so we'll be back tomorrow um but so far we've got <clears throat> The upper and lower headers put in place, the sides bolted to them. Uh, we've got the, uh, most of it sanded up pretty well. So tomorrow we're gonna get the stain for it. I gotta, obviously this is, these are a little long on the legs. I gotta cut about a foot and a half off the bottom. Um, and then we have all those that we cut earlier that we ripped and we've gotta make the lattice. So once we make the lattice, uh, we're gonna be doing a bunch of staining and uh, I'm glad I've had it I was I had him here with me he was helping me a lot he did a lot of the sanding for me which cut down a lot of time he actually did a really good job of the sanding so congrats to you but tomorrow we're gonna put him uh, staining um, like I said this is just like a little vlog and then again making the trellis we already did I did an instructional video on it before but this time I had my son helping me and uh, you know I know the COVID's going on a lot of people are stuck at home but I can't just sit around and do nothing, and uh, having him here with me, I figured we'd either be fishing or um, doing something here, yard work, and then we come up with, this would be a perfect Mother's Day, birthday gift, 
So I r roped him into helping me. So get your kids out, do something. This is a great time to be uh, very interactive with them. I know a lot of kid parents are like, man, I just wish I could get them back to daycare so I can get me some me time. But you may not have a time like this for a while. So you can make the most of it. Do some, do some things with your kids outside and enjoy the weather. Until tomorrow, we'll see you then. What's up? Back to the morning. Welcome to the next day. So, uh, as you see, just like two seconds ago for you, 12 hours for me or so, um, we got this frame finished. What we're going to do today is we're going to lay out the centerpiece and start cutting our, our uh, lattice out. And once we get everything where we think we want it, uh, we're going to lift this stuff up and we're going to do some painting or some staining. So, you excited? No. All right. We're going to get this thing knocked out today, hopefully. So let's get her done. Oh, this is fun. If you want, just paint the insides. And then you can move to the outside where you don't have to um, keep climbing over that. And we'll move the paint down. We'll move the stain down so that way it... Did your camera find Yep. So you can see we're doing a little staining now. We're going to get everything stained out. This will be a most of the day project probably with two coats. And uh, we're given a stain by the father-in-law because this is what matches most of the work he's been doing outside on his house. So this is the stain we're, we're putting on her. Blake's doing a pretty dang good job over there. Now I'll do the sides. over to the mother-in-law is going to give it to her today we're just about there we got a little red out driving her down the street so let's go give it to her and see what she thinks happy mother's day and and birthday a little bit early. Beautiful. This is the back of it, so. Oh my God! It matches. Or this. Like... This is the back. Yeah, yeah I stole his. Uh... So you knew. Oh, oh my God! What? Knew what? He stole. That's why Blake stayed, because he's been making. Blake stayed. He was supposed to go home oh. yesterday. 
Well, you know what? I was thinking about that yesterday because then I'm thinking, no, he's going home Saturday because he was supposed to go home. You know, he's. Well, we're back home. I got a little bit of her uh, reaction. Um, you know, I think she was pretty happy with it. Pretty good surprise. Uh, I was gonna get a picture of it put up, but uh, I forgot. We were kind of in a hurry. I got wanted to get home and uh, get some stuff done for dinner, and I put the camera away. But we at least I think we got her reaction to it. So overall, it was a pretty good, successful story, huh? Mm -hmm. We built the trellis together. This guy did most of the work. Did a lot of sanding. She got a nice Mother's Day slash uh, birthday present. Dunkin' Donuts is amazing. And he stops at Dunkin' Donuts and didn't get me anything. Because you don't deserve anything. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that little vlog series there. That was over a couple days, you know, between staying and whatnot. Uh, if you guys got any questions on the trellis of how to build it, I did a pretty good video, I think, on... Uh, how to build one uh, if you guys have any questions though just comment below but we want to thank you guys for watching please like subscribe share with your friends and leave a comment down below and i am better at my dad than building stuff he always thinks he's better than me he's got to learn from the best though right well thanks guys for watching actually actually brock is a carpenter and you're not so on that note, thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you next time.